lights in the sky, eyewitnesses on the ground. According to dozens of witnesses, what happened in a town in Brazil was very different. The Virginia case is considered the most well-kept secret. It is a crashed vehicle that had beings on board. Two seres extraterrestres were captured. Depois, posteriormente, foram levados para o hospital. Levantou, espalhou, veio, bateu, foi aqui. People everywhere are reporting run-ins with mysterious beings and extraordinary aircraft taking flight. These tales are as old as time, but recently they've become more than just hearsay. A crash and blink. What an emulator. Just a few weeks ago, someone recorded a UFO crashing into a Russian river a little after dawn. Since there weren't many people around, no one really knows what became of the UFO, not even the one who recorded it. But once the video made it online, a few crazy theories popped up. A few were sure the video was doctored because the falling UFO didn't register water pressure waves. No way, no way. But some are saying, if it really is an alien craft, why can't it have some sort of technology to move like this? Massive Saucer This giant saucer was captured floating above a house and was luckily caught on the surveillance camera outside. Within a few seconds, a portal opened up and the UFO disappeared inside. Well, if this is true, it'd explain how UFOs managed to evade our eyes at the very last minute. But if it is doctored, at least we know we're safe from an alien invasion. Or are we? Stealthy Flyer Oh my god, there's, there's two! While exploring Utah's rugged terrains, a hiker noticed something whizzing past from behind the trees. Oddly enough, it resembled a perfect saucer. But the hiker wasn't close enough, so all he could see was a metallic glint quickly disappearing behind the trees. There's, there's two. Driven by curiosity, the hiker ditched the route and followed the UFO, eventually racing ahead and hiding behind some rocks and tree stumps. And this is what he caught. Oh. The saucer in its full glory. And look at that, the way it instantly moved upward in a beat. That's not something we've managed to do so far. Unidentified Aerial Phenomena What started out as a ball of fire turned into one of the biggest mysteries of the century. The person recording this believed he'd caught just some sort of flare or a fireball. But the burning object quickly started twisting, and after a few minutes, unleashed black wing-like structures at its end. This might just be some sort of alien craft we haven't even imagined could exist. It's also possible this is some sort of mysterious creature. Many believe this is the Bean Elohim, or the Sons of God Angels. Extraterrestrial Visitors a couple of years ago, a man captured a massive UFO landing on the cliff behind his neighborhood. Two tall, gray, skeletal-like figures emerged from the UFO and were engaged in deep conversation. The man recording them believed they were staying on Earth for a while and were finally reuniting to discuss their observations. After a few short seconds of talking, the duo hopped back on the UFO and flew home. Now, I know we've seen a couple of crazy videos, but what truly takes the cake here is that this one hasn't been debunked yet. If this is true, it's very much possible that we've been hosting aliens for years. Tipsy Craft This peculiar UFO was spotted by a couple of people on a drive in Valdi, Chile. They quickly zoomed past, but not before capturing the site. Now, obviously, you and I think it's just some sort of cartoonish craft, but when locals heard about it, they flocked to the area only to find it missing. That's weird. Why should a UFO disappear, especially if it's fake? 
hilly takeoff. This is what a couple of tourists filmed while they were vacationing just off the coast in Puerto Rico. Before they'd even gotten over the shock of the first UFO, it summoned an entire army ready to take the world. The fleet rose from the cliff and sped towards the skies. Now, before we freak out, let's just take a minute to remember that, despite this visual, there haven't been any other things going on in the area. So, we're probably safe for now. Forrest Gump This tall gray alien was recently captured on camera in all its glory. You can clearly see face, arms, and eyes as it slowly walks away. You can also hear a helicopter in the background, which makes me think it's the military looking for the creature. Which may have escaped from a certain popular holding site. Despite some folks claiming that it was a hoax, it was uploaded on a UFO website. But was quickly removed when it got too popular. Which kind of means the government probably had it removed so its secrets wouldn't be outed. Glow in the Dark In 2023, a man named Jeff Kessler was camping in the woods but felt like he was being watched, so he pulled out his camera in case anything happened. After hearing rustling outside his tent, he got out to investigate and noticed a tall figure. But before he could record any further, the video was cut short and Kessler has never been heard from ever again. Explorers later discovered his phone and retrieved this footage, which after being stabilized, reveals this oddly green humanoid. Many believe this creature may have unwillingly taken Kessler along with it. A Quick Getaway a helicopter pilot noticed this weird metallic object quickly flying right by, flying low over the sea. The UFO seemed to be moving in the same direction as the pilot, who couldn't believe his luck. But just as they reached a certain point, the UFO took a sharp turn and fooled the pilot. Now, I know you, like me, would argue that it's just a drone. But here's the thing. For a drone to fly this long, the drone owner must be nearby. Even if we say the owner is in the helicopter and is just staging the video, since when have drones been able to make a sharp turn like that without losing all its senses? You're a gray puzzle. In 1994, authorities received a flurry of reports about a flying saucer gracing the skies in Uruguay. But since there was no concrete proof, they chalked it up to a neighborhood wide prank and closed the case. Until a few years later, this video surfaced, allegedly, of the same UFO that was seen in the country. The mysterious craft seemed to slowly scan the neighborhood as if it was on the lookout for signs of trouble or potential victims. As it eventually disappeared from sight, you can see its exit was blocked by the thumb of the cameraman. But even though the video is now on the internet, no clue that uploaded it, suggesting he may have been silenced. Colombiana. Do you know the perfect place to land a UFO? Right in the middle of a remote rainforest in Colombia. Surely no one would find out, right? That's probably what this UFO was thinking, not knowing that it was being recorded just as it soared over the forest. Luckily captured by a tour guide nearby, the UFO was oddly positioned not moving a single inch. Some experts believe the UFO might be traveling across dimensions, which is why it remains still here. It's just that we can't see it properly. Roof Crawler A Brazilian resident captured some sort of humanoid creature crawling over his neighbor's roof after hearing weird clangs all day. For a while, the creature looked as if it didn't know it was being recorded, since it remained there for a short few seconds. But something disrupted it, and it disappeared. Here's a closer view. Yep, that doesn't look like any sort of animal, and it's too thin to be someone playing dress-up. The scarier part? Whatever disturbed it also looks like an alien. But because the cameraman was scared, we couldn't get a closer look. Brazilian alien. 
consegue captar as vibrações. Vem até nós. A few months ago, Brazilian residents captured two tall aliens standing atop a hill. The duo was clearly scanning the area, but quickly disappeared from view when they noticed they were being filmed. A few hours later, one of them was seen behind a house, but it too quickly vanished. Terrifyingly, both of them were at least 10 feet tall, which explains why they were clearly visible even from afar. But locals claim the hill is practically unclimbable. <laughs> Haunted with loneliness. A man on a hike found an abandoned place far from the city. It was a one-room house with no lock, and from the darkness emerged a creature crawling slowly, its body twisted upside down in a way that defied nature. The eerie scene was enough to send anyone running. An unusual celebration. During a child's birthday party, some strange sounds started coming from outside, catching everyone's attention. The kids excitedly claimed they saw something odd through the window, which led the person filming the party to head outside with the camera. To their surprise, they captured footage of a tall, green figure with long arms casually walking across the street. Well, that's one way to make a birthday party exciting. The Bright Side These bright orbs were filmed by a tourist from their hotel room. And I've scoured the internet, but can't really find an explanation. It's not flares because of the height, and it's certainly not two suns. It can't be the reflection of a bulb either. So honestly, I'm a bit speechless. Past Problems This video of an alleged UFO in South Africa first surfaced in 2003, but was instantly forgotten. Until a decade later, experts analyzed it and confirmed it wasn't doctored. The craft was debunked because it was wobbling. But you can clearly see that the top is rotating and the bottom is spinning in a different direction. Some tried to debunk it, claiming the blur in the sunlight was at the wrong aperture but experts pointed out that the way it's moving would account for that. Well, a UFO enthusiast can dream. Nevada's mystery. Don, are you seeing this? These stealthy alien crafts were flying low over the central Nevada desert and were filmed by an anonymous man. The trio seemed to be flying in succession, almost as if heading to the same spot to hold a secret meeting but their peaceful rendezvous was unexpectedly cut off when another craft followed suit with two more in pursuit. If you look closely, the crafts look like USAF F-22 Raptors, prompting rumors that the US government knows we're hosting alien visitors and is ready to employ the Air Force if needed. Some even believe the one who posted the video is in the Air Force and was airing out its dirty laundry, which is why he decided to stay anonymous. Nebula in the Sky Ready for this one? This was recently captured in Colorado. And before you chalk it off to just a stupid drone show or a skydiver hooked to some flares, check this out. Yep, now that we've seen it twist and turn like that, it doesn't really look like something that could be man-made now, does it? And here's the showstopper. Look how it ejects two glowing rings. If I didn't know any better, it could very much be some sort of signal. Witnesses believe they've actually captured a massive outwardly being, glimpsing Earth for a fleeting moment. While a few are sure this is some alien craft. Silver Lining a video recently captured a mysterious object moving somewhere over the Andes, sparking discussions it could be the infamous Black Knight satellite. If you didn't know, the Black Knight satellite theory talks about a supposed spacecraft from outer space orbiting Earth in a near polar path. According to the story, NASA knows it's there, but keeps it a secret. Since we've known about the UFO for a while, this might just be the first time 
that we've been able to put a face to it. The Kite Flyer We've all been mentally preparing for stereotypical UFOs, but what if you see something that resembles Hellfire? It almost would have gone unnoticed if it weren't for an eagle-eyed resident who noticed the moon looked off. When he zoomed in with his camera, he realized the object wasn't the moon at all, but a strange UFO that glowed hot red with red. Once it was uploaded, a few chimed in that it could be some sort of secret technology being tested by the government. But what for? Who knows? Prism Break Isn't it odd that more and more triangle UFOs are finally streaking our skies? It's almost like they've been outed and have been given up trying to hide. Considering how the government has confirmed alien existence, it doesn't really sound too far-fetched, does it? This one was seen on St. Catalina Island in California. And whoa! Something clearly just flashed above it and zoomed back up. Now that I think about it, what if other alien ships regularly visit to instruct these ones and take off? Ice Ice Baby Since we rarely visit the Antarctic, who knows what hides there? This UFO is clearly taking advantage of this opportunity. Just look how boldly it's cruising at a low altitude, knowing very well there isn't any way someone could stop it. You're probably wondering how it was recorded. The most popular theory sides with a motion-detecting camera left out by an expedition team. But while a few believe the video could be edited, here's one indicator that suggests otherwise. Its movement is clearly leaving a trail, which means there is something tangible enough to disrupt the waves. Trigon Flight We've seen a few saucer-shaped UFOs, but what about the triangle ones that have been haunting the world for a while now? This isn't the first time this nacho-shaped UFO has been seen over American skies. The same spaceship has been noticed in multiple cities around the world, but this angle is giving us a lot to think about. Obviously, the central circle must be some sort of doorway to the craft, but since it quickly sped out of view, we don't have much to go on about. Peeping Tom On July 17, 2003, Stan Romanek and his wife set up a camcorder aimed at their window, capturing something that scared them deeply. A small gray figure with big black eyes resembling an alien appeared looking in through the window. It moved its head and gestured in a very human-like way. When Stan approached the window to get a closer look, the alien quickly hid and then darted away. Although we don't have many visuals, Stan swears this wasn't the first or last time an extraterrestrial paid him a visit. Backyard Visitor A man was filming in his backyard when he heard a strange noise and turn, only to capture some alien being pulling itself from its roof. The sight spooked him so much he almost lost balance during which the alien made a getaway and disappeared from sight. This happened way back in Mexico in 2009, and although it's been on the internet for a while, it has yet to be debunked. All I know is, it can't be a prank, because you'd need a lot of muscle strength to pull this stunt off. A Secret Meeting Care to find out what the government is doing right under our noses? Check out this footage allegedly leaked from Area 51, right behind the patrolling guards. There you go, that's a UFO. Now the video cuts off a little too early, but here's why I think this is real. The UFO isn't tiny like we've seen from time to time, which means it looks like an actual vehicle that could actually seat someone. What do you think? The Yard Run This is the exact spot that I just... 
During a Facebook Live, this man was sharing his experience about a weird run-in with an unidentified creature in his backyard. To reenact the incident, he opened his back door and unexpectedly captured something dashing across his backyard. It was the same creature. And luckily for him, it was recorded on camera. And check this out. That's some sort of demonic alien, isn't it? Well, he better list the property as soon as possible. <laughs> Ohioan Cruiser A man driving close to Kingsland in Ohio caught a metallic glint from the corner of his eyes. When he zoomed in, he realized it was a saucer-shaped object cruising the sky at a low altitude. That's certainly weird, because why on earth would a UFO not stay high up in the skies? or it could camouflage with the clouds. As he was driving through the neighborhood, he almost lost sight of the UFO for a few short seconds. But later caught it turning toward the woods at the back. The way it tilted suggests the UFO was close to landing. But since he couldn't really pinpoint where, we don't know much about it. Boat Creeper all right, what is this? A fisherman saw something trying to rummage through his boat and immediately recorded it. It looked like a weird pulsating creature capable of squeezing through narrow crevices, just like it was doing here. The brave fisherman even touched the creature's hand, and weirdly enough, it retreated slowly, as if not expecting any resistance on the other side. Now, I'm all for aliens visiting the Earth and whatnot, but I'm a bit stumped on what this is. A few claim it's some sort of animal, while others are sure it's an extraterrestrial. Voodoo Craft Look what we have here! Some sort of UFO trying its best to stay afloat, sticking to the same area in hopes that no one might notice it's up there, but was evidently recorded by a woman out on a walk. Now, we've had our fair share of UFOs, but this one's really odd because it isn't moving. It could be that whoever's manning the UFO's cockpit didn't expect to be seen. Or maybe it's too shameless to hide itself and is openly declaring war. Short Runner A homeowner heard weird noises from her living room and decided to record it. As she filmed, a small grayish white figure quickly ran past. The video was blurry, but you could see the creature's long oval head. She believed an alien had been on her windowsill before jumping out. The Backyard Again A resident kept getting bothered by his motion sensor light activating. So, one day, he checked his security camera to find out why. He saw a strange figure with a bony face and big black eyes in the footage. It seemed like the creature was examining the door, possibly looking for a way in. This sighting unsettled the resident. So he enhanced the video's brightness for a better look at the alien-like face. And yep, that's the stuff of nightmares! Luckily for him, the alien failed in its attempts and didn't appear after that again. I Spy A man filming his house got a huge shock when he noticed a weird creature covered in white staring at him from the roof. He didn't scream, probably too scared to make a sound but the creepy creature didn't stick around and vanished quickly. The guy caught it on camera and posted the video online, hoping to figure out what it was. Some people thought it was an alien. Others guessed maybe someone was spying on him. If it really was an alien, why did it run off? Was it truly an alien or just a trick? Texan Mess In April 2008, a homeowner in Houston, Texas whipped out his camera when he heard a weird buzzing coming from his backyard. The saucer-shaped aircraft seemed to be floating over another house just a street ahead, so the homeowner could record it easily without being seen himself. 
After a few seconds of mindlessly floating, the UFO shifted into first gear and started moving over the rest of the neighborhood. Here's a closer look. There's clearly some sort of shaft or base at the bottom, which means this isn't just some aircraft. It's one that had someone or something sitting inside it at that very moment. Well, I wonder what happened to the UFO. Peruvian creatures. Mira, huevón, puta madre, casa. A few months ago, a tourist in Peru captured what he believed was a bird sitting at the very top of a tree. But once he got back to his hotel and reviewed the video, he noticed something strange. The bird had long arms, almost like a human. Freaked out, he replayed the video and it all came back clear. It was some sort of humanoid, effortlessly balancing itself on top of the tree. It's certainly not a human playing a prank because who else is able to defy gravity like this? Mexican humanoid. A couple of hikers in August Salinxis, Mexico, witnessed a human-like creature standing at the top of a cliff nearby. Although it looked very much like us, the creature was too tall to be one of us, which can only mean one thing. This is some sort of giant alien that managed to make it on camera. Witness continued recording it for a while, observing its every move, unable to decide what to do. If you're like me, you're probably wondering why nobody went up the hill. That's because it's one of the steepest in the area and isn't climbable. And yet, there the giant was, casually standing at the very tip as if gravity was just a ruse. Brazilian Glow I always believed in aliens, but seeing one on camera? That was something I never expected. Then this footage from Brazil showed up. A giant glowing gold figure moving across the hills. People started guessing. Some joked it was a super cyan. Others thought maybe just a glare on the camera. But honestly, who can say for sure? It could be anything from a ghostly figure to an angel or even an alien. Colossal alien. It's a person, dude. Over the mountains of British Columbia, Canada, a giant figure was spotted standing tall as if it owned the world. It looked like something from a legend had stepped into the real world. Most might say it's just a person, but given the angle and distance, no human could appear that massive. As the person filming watched, this mysterious giant started to move, then vanished from sight all of a sudden. This sudden disappearance convinced them that perhaps the mountains are home to giant extraterrestrial beings who on occasion step out into the human world. Roof Beast a woman filmed her neighbor's ducks feeding but didn't realize she caught something else until she showed the video to her husband. Just at the upper extreme left of the clip, you can see something perched on the roof. Here's a more stabilized version. Alright, what is this? Some sort of demon ready to feast or an alien keeping watch? Your guess is as good as mine. Up and Beyond on February 27th in the southern state of Kamshi, eyewitnesses caught a glimpse of something extraordinary. A peculiar light streaked across the sky, nestled above the clouds. At first thought, one might consider it an airplane. However, the light it emitted, it was unlike any known aircraft. This unusual spectacle has sparked curiosity and wonder, what could it be? The answers remain as mysterious as the light itself. Into the Unknown the skies in China recently split open and unveiled this unusual sight. The bizarre bright beam descended to the ground, as if opening up a portal for immortal creatures to escape through. It's also rather creepy that the portal is shaped exactly like a saucer, much like those typical UFOs. This is why locals are convinced it's actually an alien craft staking out the area and releasing its passengers to wreak havoc on Earth. But let's just hope this is a bunch of rumors. Backtrotter a man was filming his trail camera footage with his friend when the duo noticed something quickly passed the camera. A simple rewind, and initially it looks like a human, but see here? The legs are way too oddly shaped to be a human's. The creature seems to be holding something in his hand, which raises some serious questions. Well, let's hope it stays hidden. Russian Angel 
On January 16, 2024, an odd metallic ring emerged from the Russian sky in St. Petersburg and was visible for just a few minutes. As it switched gears and intertwined with another ring, glowing orbs surrounded it. The sight naturally spooked a few people who freaked out when the ring began blinking vigorously, as if signaling another craft in the area. Weirdly enough, this wasn't the only time the same ring was seen. It was also captured flying over a neighborhood in Texas, miles away from Russia. Of course, this only fuel conspiracy theorists who are sure the U.S. government is partnering with aliens to take over the world. Yeah, right. Sun-kissed flyer. A homeowner captured a mysterious bright orb lighting up the sky from their window. Initially believing they'd captured some sort of meteorological phenomena, they knew they were seeing something else when the orb picked up toward the sky. The movement was so startling the homeowner almost stopped recording, but composed themselves and witnessed the glowing orb slowly move higher and higher until it was no longer visible. The homeowner believes they've captured an actual UFO, but who knows? The Brugia. This creepy figure was seen sitting at the top of a tree. But weirdly enough, it didn't look like gravity was even pulling her down, which is why residents believe it's actually a Brugia, a witch that was previously thought to just be an old wives' tale. But here she was, casually perched on the treetop like a bird. She disappeared back into the trees after a while, but who knows if she's still cruising the skies. Tex-Mex Accompanied by a bright flash of light, a daunting UFO appeared in the sky over Texas a few weeks ago and has left witnesses worrying about their safety. You can't argue that it's some sort of drone or flare. They wouldn't flash that bright. Plus, you can see a metallic object circling within the light. I haven't really found much about this video, so it's possible it's a fake. But if you've got any idea, clue me in. Oceanic Invasion A few weeks ago, an Italian citizen out on a walk noticed these glowing blimps crashing into a river. It happened so quickly the person barely had time to react, but following the duo was an entire fleet of orbs hurtling towards the river and crashing into the depths. Honestly, I think this could just be a drone show gone wrong, but a few UFO enthusiasts are sure this is some sort of an alien invasion waiting to unfold. What do you think? Cloudburst This white cloud was floating above a city in the Philippines. And yes, you're seeing that right. There's something black and sleek hiding in the cloud. Not so slick, is it? Of course, while it's easy to blame this on the weather, nothing explains a black ring floating above like that. But here's the crazier part. Here's a different angle of the same thing filmed from much higher, and that's obviously some sort of craft. And look, there's something walking on it too, which is only fueling conspiracies about gravity-defying aliens. It's time for today's open discussion. In 1996, residents of Virginia, Brazil reported sightings of a strange humanoid creature, but their claims were met with skepticism. A few weeks later, this video emerged, clearly showing a bizarre humanoid figure. Later, another video popped up, this time of the alien walking, adding more proof to the claims. But as the evidence piled up, so did rumors of a cover-up, with talks about the military stepping in to keep things quiet. By the time locals went back to the same area, it had been picked clean, with nothing but a few crumbs behind. People believe the military purposely hid everything, because it was involved somehow. But it's a story that's missing a lot of chapters.